everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I thought that today I would pop on a Tesco food haul just because it's been delivered and I thought I may as well film it. I still need to pop my Slimming World update video on if I can this week. The reason that it's not gone on is because it sounds ridiculous but I cut the end of my nose last night and it literally didn't stop bleeding for about four hours so I just couldn't film it I'm afraid and I thought it would look a bit silly to have a tissue stuck on the end of my nose so yeah that's the reason it's not up yet i will try and pop it up if i can over the weekend if not i might just stick it over on instagram with a short story or just a little written update just to say how i did but i will try and pop the video on if i can I have my little helper don't i leo yeah yeah so we're just going to show everyone what we bought this week so we have got a four pint of semi-skimmed two four pint of whole milk one two three one two three that's it one of the Tesco fabric conditioners, two of the Tesco non-bio capsules because everyone seems to get on quite well with those. Over the back there we have a 12 pack of caffeine free diet cokes, two of these flavoured waters because they are both free on Simming World. And then to the slightly naughtier bit we've got some custard creams for my husband, some mini rolls for the kids as a treat and some of these roses orange greens. These were both on offer and then a pack of Muller Lights because they're only like either half or one thin and I've gone for the chocolatey sprinkle ones because they feel like a real treat even though they're very low. Four pack of yogurts and then our usual small pork cocktail sausages, the frozen ones we just fry them off as and when we need them for picnics and things. Over the back there, a packet of smiles, just as a treat for the kids. A packet of these crispy potatoes, and I thought I'd just get these for the kids as a treat. They just stay in the freezer until we kind of get through them all, but they're the crispy potato pops, which remind me of what we used to have on holiday in France when we were small kids sometimes as a treat. So yeah, I thought I'd try those ones. Two of the Hearty Food Company Garlic Kievs, just because they are just ridiculously cheap. You just like having a few quick things in the freezer. A pack of codfish fingers, a pack of the Wiltshire cured ham because I think that was on offer at a couple of pounds and I thought it looked quite tasty. A pack of mini cheddars just because sometimes the kids like cheese and crackers for lunch with some salady bits instead of sandwiches. We've got two packs of jacket potatoes. These are on offer at the moment and I just like the fact that they're big potatoes and you only have to peel like three or four for tea and you don't have to sit there peeling loads of mini potatoes when you get these packs, you never know what size ones you're gonna get. So I tend to just go for these now and they last us a week. So eight reasonable sized potatoes. A pack of small bananas, just because they are just the right size for the kids. So they will ripen up at home. Some onion rings, because again, they're my husband's favorite. I thought I'd try these. These are oven baked with veg, sweet potato with paprika. And the kids really love snacking on crackers and things, so I thought for a change we could try those ones. We've also got the Cathedral Bites because they're a hit with Lucy especially, and six packs of mini breadsticks. Some ketchup, a tub of Bisto, one of these creamy tomato and herb pasta bakes, just because we make a tuna pasta bake with that one, or sometimes they just have a really quick tea of that with some cheese and pasta and some salad on the side if we're in a real, real rush. A hove is best of both. Two packs of the oven baked cheese and onion because they're Leo's favourite. A pack of bunny bites. Pack of Tesco's Ridge Crisps, which are basically like McCoy's but much, much cheaper. And then over here, a big pack of spinach because I'm really, really enjoying that at the moment, especially on Slimming World. I'm convinced that that gives me a better weight loss. I had no spinach last week and I have done appallingly at Slimming World this week for the first week since joining. So I'm wondering if it is slightly to do with the fact that I haven't had tons of this on my plate every week. A big pack of carrots just to last us the week. Over here, a baby leaf salad because that was half price. A big stem of broccoli just to last us again. Some baby plum tomatoes, two of the half cucumbers, and these are on offer again, which was a pack of flat peaches, which we all enjoy. And that's everything. It was a pretty cheap shop. I think it came to a shade over £50. We have very, very little in the way of meat, I realise. All we really have is a couple of frozen bits for quick dinners as and when we need them. That's because I have got mince and chicken and fish. Everything you can imagine really still in the freezer from the last few shops that we haven't got through because we've been out and about a bit more so we just haven't used it. But yeah, that is everything. Really just a top up shop and along with the bits in the freezer that will do us nicely for the week. 
Thank you so much for watching my video. I really hope you enjoyed it. We'll try, like I said earlier, to pop a Slim World update video on for anyone who's interested. If I can't, then I will pop it over on Instagram, mama underscore hedgehog2. I'd absolutely love for you to subscribe to my channel. That would be amazing. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.